Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Today I'm going to be reviewing uh, something a little bit different. Uh, it is another unique uh, hot and spicy uh, condiment. And this is a honey. And this one here is from Geddes Farms. And this is their blazing hot 100% natural ghost pepper honey. Now this is, uh, the way they're doing this, this is, um, they've put one whole ghost pepper as you can see I believe it's a dried ghost pepper uh, inside this jar of natural honey all right well, I want to go ahead and share a little bit about them now this was sent to me from Harry Poff now um, let me read a little bit about uh, Geddes Farms now Will Geddes has been a hobby beekeeper for 28 years and is a member of the Central Maryland Beekeeping Association Will and his wife Mary have entered their honey and wax in the Maryland State Fair and have had excellent success throughout their beekeeping career. Honey is judged on taste, clarity, absence of, absence of crystals, absence of foam, and accuracy of jar filling. Well, there's a lot of stuff I don't know about honey. Uh, many friends and acquaintances have requested Will's personal local honey to aid in allergy prevention and all have reported excellent results. He has been interested in varietal honey for 30 years. Will has used his honey experience, expertise to bring quality honey to people. Honey is his passion and he enjoys sharing it with everyone. Out of his, this interest in beekeeping and raw honey, the inspiration for Geddes Farms emerged. He has extensive travel experience and has met with fellow beekeepers from Brazil, Vietnam, China, India, France, Germany, Russia, Poland, and Turkey. Will has hand-selected each of the honeys that we offer from sources that he trusts and that use best practices to preserve honey, honey quality and promote the sustainability of the bees in their care. Now, Will Geddes is 56 years old and extremely active in outdoor activities, including mountain climbing, fishing, and camping. He is a third-generation president and owner of Raymond Geddes & Company, Incorporated, who produces a line of novelty stationery for kids and kids at heart. And you can find Raymond Geddes products in 30,000 school stores around the com company, country and many chain stores. Now, founded in 1924, Raymond Geddes and Company Incorporated is cele celebrated their 90th year anniversary. All right. Now, uh, you can check them out at GeddesFarms.com, but they have uh, just a, a tremendous amount of different flavored honeys so uh the one he wanted me to try was the uh the ghost pepper honey so let's go ahead and get into this um i don't think i need to read too much about this of course it's just honey and ghost pepper so let's go ahead and check this out it's got a pr pretty cool looking label here on the uh on the top blazing hot ghost pepper honey now it smells like honey but this has got a very uh, a nice consistency to it, just like a pure honey does. Now here's that ghost pepper. I'm not going to take that out, but I just want you to see it right there. So let's go ahead and check this out and see how that that's uh, flavored, uh, the honey. See if I can do this without making a mess. Here we go. Now, as far as the honey goes, it is very, very good. I can I can taste a difference in this particular honey uh, than some of that other crap that you might get uh, through the supermarket. I mean, this has got an awesome flavor, a really, really good flavor on it. But the thing that I have to be honest about it, disappointing, it is not hot. It is not spicy. And I've had other honeys uh, that um, used uh, peppers, but they were blended in or that they were crushed or they were blended in and I think if you're going to try to make a spicy honey then it's really not going to do it uh, by just putting a uh, dried pod in there um, it's just it just didn't really make it all that spicy to me um, I'm not really picking up on ghost pepper or anything maybe just very very slightly now I know I'm a chili head and my tolerance is pretty high so uh, uh, maybe to some other people, they might pick up on the spiciness or the heat uh, from that pepper that's in here. But um, I'm really not picking up on it. 
or really at all. Um, it just tastes like a, uh, mm. a regular honey. Very, very delicious. Um, maybe just ever so slightly. Um, I'm really not picking up any heat at all. Uh, so I'll give it a one, though, one out of ten. But uh, I think if you're going to really, um, so it's not blazing hot, but it is a very, very good tasting honey. I think if you're going to do it, uh, I think it needs to be blended up, crushed in there. And I think that's the way to, uh, to really infuse, uh, get the heat and the flavor of the pepper inside the honey. But uh, awesome product uh, on flavor. I'll give it a 9 out of 10 for flavor. Once again, on heat, just a 1 out of 10. Um, not really picking up much heat at all, but a very, very uh, fine tasting honey. You can tell it's 100% natural. It's very well done. Um, check these guys out. Uh, give them a like on Facebook. And the website simply is GettusFarms.com. I'll put the link down in the description. They have a lot of different honeys. Uh, varietal type honeys uh, so you have to check it out to get all the different flavor profiles for their honey but they look awesome so uh, Paul thank you very much for sending it I really do appreciate it and uh, or Harry I'm sorry thank you very much for sending it and until the next time everybody enjoy the burn we'll see you guys later